Hi, boys and girls. Oh, you have a workout that you have previously done before. So if you look back to the second week of the first lockdown, you would have completed this very workout. So it's a good time to kind of test where you're at, uh, maybe push yourselves to try and beat what your last score was, have fun with it. So 15 minute AMRAP today, you're gonna complete 15 glute bridges, 15 V-ups, 15 squat jumps, 15 mountain climbers, and then 15 jumping jacks. So it's all body weight movements. Um, nothing should be slowing you down too much. Um, ideally, we're kind of looking for somewhere between sort of five and seven rounds. Um, but yeah, trying to make sure that nothing is stopping you. So some things that you might want to consider. So firstly, if you're kind of worried with the number, so 15 reps, you could cut that down to possibly 10. So you're just keeping moving without stopping. Um, in terms of scaling, so some of you might want to scale back your V-ups, possibly to your tuck-ups. Again, if you're a little, little bit struggling with the, the coordination element of that, you can go to an ordinary sit-up there instead. The, the thing that you might want to scale here is gonna be those squat jumps. So for any of you that maybe think 15 of those is gonna be challenging, just go with an air squat today. It's still gonna be really, really challenging, and I guarantee you, you will feel those glutes at the end of it. So that's your workout. Um, and then part B today, you're gonna complete more glute bridges. This time you're gonna get 10 single leg reps on each side. Um, you can rest as needed. And then you're gonna complete 30 seconds side plank on each side. Okay, so two parts to that session. Enjoy, feel those glutes, feel those abs. See you on Sugarwood. Good team. So you should know what we're doing for our workout by now. What we're gonna do for our warm up to get you side is two rounds. We're gonna do 30 seconds of work on each station. Station one is gonna be down ups. Station two is gonna be air squats. Station three, we're gonna get a hollow hold in. And then station four, we're gonna get a Spider-Man with rotation. So grab a drink. We're gonna go in 10 seconds. We're kicking things off with a bang, starting with those down ups. What a stitch up. We're going down to a tall plank position. Feet to hands. And then just standing tall at the top. All right. Good, that's eight, just a nice little ease into it. We then got our air squats. So I've got my feet at shoulder width, squatting all the way down, and standing tall. Each of my air squats are accompanied with a loud clicking of the knee. No pain, so no problem. Here at station three, we're going into our hollow hold. It's only a warm up, I'm gonna take it easy. I'm gonna go for a hollow tuck to begin with. I'm squeezing my abs. I've got my shoulders off the floor and I've got my bum off the floor as well. Shaking like a leaf, 10 seconds. Okay, so we're then going into a Spider-Man with rotation. Because we're doing two rounds, I'm gonna to stick to this whole round on the one side. I brought my heel up to my palm. I'm rotating round and following it with my eyes. Wicked, so we're back to those down ups. I've got eight to beat. Oh, matched it. 
on back to those air squats team. Again, just nice and steady. It's just a warm up. No need to go crazy. Okay, we're back to that hollow hold. I'm gonna make it a little bit more challenging this time. I'm gonna have my legs extended, but I'm keeping my arms crossed. Again, I've got my shoulders off the floor. I'm pointing my toes and squeezing my abs. Good, okay, nice and steady. Onto that spider man with the rotation again. I'm gonna swap sides this time though. So, there we have it team, two rounds, 30 seconds on each station. Should be feeling a little bit warmer now. If you need to pause the video, please do. Grab yourself a drink, then we're gonna get straight in to our workout piece. So team, just to remind you, we're gonna get a 15 minute AMRAM. Obviously each station is 15 reps. We've got that glute bridge, our V-up, our squat jumps, our mountain climbers, and our jumping jacks. The aim of this one is just steady movement throughout. So, we're gonna go in 10 seconds, and we're gonna start with that glute bridge team. This is a repeat, so have a look on Sugarwad, check your notes, you might have put something worthwhile. On those glute bridge, we're gonna be lying on our back. I'm gonna have my weight on my heels and my toes facing up. I'm then gonna bridge up and squeeze my bum maximally at the top. Try not to overextend through your back. If you're feeling this a lot in your hamstrings, walk your feet closer to your bum. 10, good, that's 15. The next station we've got is our V-ups. I'm no ninja, so I'm just gonna be doing tuck-ups today, team. And that even might get scaled as well. <laughs> Remember, we're going back to that hollow position, so don't just lie on the floor. Fifteen. Oh. Then you've got those squat jumps. Now, because my knees don't like me at the best of time, team, I'm just going to do an air squat today. If you're opting for that squat jump, that's going to get very tough very quickly. And I imagine that's going to be the hardest station in all of this workout. but it is a Monday, so nobody's gonna get on your case if you take it a little bit easier. Two more. We then got those mountain climbers team. Remember, left and right is one repetition. Nice. Jumping jacks. If you've got a rope, you can feel free. Let's do some skipping. Good. 
Okay, one round done. Took about three minutes. Remember, we want to be consistent throughout. So I'm back to those glute bridges. Again, to remind you team, I've got my weight on my heels, my toes are facing the roof. I'm locking those ribs down. I then bridge up with my hips. When you're at the top, I want you to squeeze your bum as hard as you can for a couple of seconds. Fifteen. Okay, we're then back to those tuck ups. Remember, don't let those shoulders or your bum fall back onto the floor. Oh, gonna have abs like steel after this one, team. Back to those squats then. Got my feet at shoulder width, sending my hips back and down, and standing all the way tall. Okay, that's 10, I've got five more. One more for me, team. Okay, and then back to those mountain climbers. Oh, 15. Back to our jumping jacks team. Nice, so a little bit quicker that time. I'm gonna grab a drink. I'm looking to hold that three minute around pace. And that's gonna give me about five rounds. Don't think that's gonna get me at the top of the leaderboard, but something's always better than nothing, right team? Again, like I said at the beginning, if you've already done this workout a couple of times and you wanted to make it a bit more challenging, you could load these glute bridges a little bit. As long as we're still maintaining those points of performance. Two more for me, guys. Fantastic. Oh, back to those V-ups. Five more. Fifteen. I might need to break those up next time. Ten and five. As long as I move pretty steadily throughout, that's going to be okay. For those of you doing those squat jumps, I bet your legs are burning by now. Good, I've got five more, team. Oh, 
Wicked, we're back to those mountain climbers. Ten. Whew. That's 15. I'm back to those jumping jacks. Fifteen. Again, I'm on track for that three minutes around pace. Okay, we're going back to our glute bridges team. Starting that third round, nice and steady. Getting one workout under the belt at the start of the week, team. If you're anything like me, you're still burning off some of those pancakes from Pancake Day last Tuesday. I want to hear what you had. Mine definitely looked a little bit like type 2 diabetes. Had some pancakes, some sugar, some whipped cream, had some chocolate syrup. Not big on health, but big on flavour team. Fast 10, five more. Oh, those are getting tough. Okay. I'm back to those squat jumps. Nice and steady. Good. Next one's 10. One more makes 15. Wicked, so we're back to those mountain climbers team. Nice quick one. Ten. Fifteen. My assistants haven't noticed. Uh, music is off in the studio. A little cry for help. I'm sure you guys don't like hearing me breathing. I also don't like it. Thanks, studio team. So team, there we have it, that's four rounds. We're a little bit ahead of pace. We've got about three minutes left. We're going to just keep moving nice and steady. Twelve. Two more. 15. Okay, we're on those tuck ups one more time. See if we can go unbroken once more. Five. Keep those tummy muscles tight, point those toes.
Okay, get three more. Yikes, that was tough. Fair play to anyone who's doing those as tuck-ups today. Or V-ups, I should say. Apologies. Five. Five more for me. One more team. Okay, that's 15 squats done. We're back to those mountain climbers. Fifteen team. We're back to those jumping jacks. For me, that's going to be the last time on them. Fifteen. Just less than a minute left. We're going to keep moving steadily throughout the whole thing, though, team. Okay. We've got about 30 seconds left, team. So if you're at home, keep pushing through. Every rep counts. Okay, last 10. Keep pushing that pace. There we have it, team. Grab yourself a drink quickly. I know I will be. 15, move in. 15, move in. We've got a workout brain team. 15 minutes of steady moving. I've got five rounds and 19 reps. Not going to be top of the leaderboard with that one. I expect you all to get anywhere between five, maybe upwards to seven. Seven and a bit change. Pause the video now if you need to, grab a drink. You'll then join us back for our accessories for the day. Team, so should have taken a couple of minutes now. Nothing too crazy. Should have grabbed a drink. We're going to move on to our accessory pieces for today. We have a little bit more glute and core work to finish you off. We're going to get three sets of 10 single leg glute bridge on each side, followed by 30 seconds and a side plank on each side. You can rest as needed, but I'm gonna just move steadily throughout on this one. So, going in 10 seconds, team. Again, can't get the staff these days, don't worry. I'll set the clock and I'll come back on for it. Don't worry, team. I'm seeing you through to the end, all right? So we're going back to those 10 single leg loop bridge. I'm going to start with obviously my leg extended. I'm going to bridge up and squeeze my bum at the top. Again, now we've gone to that single leg element. You really want to focus on not overextending through your back. If you find the single leg glute bridge too hard, you can just scale this one to 20 of our regular glute bridges. If you didn't load them in the workout, feel free to load them now. You might find one side harder than the other. That is completely natural, team. Two more for me, guys. Okay, I'm now back to our 30 seconds in a side plank. I'm going to bridge up off my knee for this first round. Okay, so nice round 30 seconds starting on that minute mark. So team, some of the studio magic is we normally have a small stop clock in front of us so we don't have to keep looking 
at the clock behind us. But once again, I've been let down by Walt, okay? He is off the mark today. He only has one job, that's to make me look fabulous. And it's been hurdle after hurdle today, team, I can promise you that. Okay, look at that. With a one take crew, this won't be edited out post production either. The people need to know Walt. On this side plank team, remember we're focusing on bridging up. We're squeezing the bum, squeezing the tummy, and having a straight line from our head to our heels. If you wanted to make this one harder, obviously you can extend both legs, and you can even put a small weight on your hip. It's gonna add a little bit more load. So that's one round down. We've got two more to go, so I'm back to my single leg glute bridge. Again, it's 10 reps on each. Remember, if you, can't, if you struggle with this one, you can do a regular glute bridge, but maybe just load it. Oh, that's getting tough. Okay, I've got three more on this side, guys. Okay, that's my turn. I'm back to our 30 seconds in a side plank. We're gonna go in three, two, one. Good, this shouldn't be too challenging team. It's just a little bit of accessory work to keep us ticking through. Okay, five, four, three, two, one. We're gonna change sides. We're gonna go again. Okay. Okay, 15 seconds, team. I've got five seconds left. Okay, that's two rounds down. We've got one to go, ladies and gents. So I'm back to my single leg glute bridges for the last time, team. Oh, those got tough. Okay, last 10. One more. Last 10. Okay, we're on those 30 second side planks for the last time, team. Okay, good, there we have it. Good, remember I'm squeezing my bum, squeezing my tummy, and trying to keep that straight line from my head to my heels. Five seconds. Okay. Okay, last 30 seconds, ladies and gents. Three, 
three, two, one. So there we have it team, three sets, 10 single leg glute bridge on each side, followed by 30 seconds and a plank on each side. Took about seven minutes. I hope you've enjoyed following along and had a good start to the week. Nice job on never missing the Monday. We'll see you on Sugar War team.